He's now coming back again. Interesting. You, you tell me he's added yardage to his uh, to his, his his shots this this season. Yeah, I think he has. But there's a combination of that. I mean, I, I don't I don't know. I'm not really sort of like on the inside track to know you know how much difficulty he's having with the, with the equipment. You know, when he had the the equipment change. Um, I mean, for me, I could sort of. Could was Faldo right there to say that <clears> he felt that he he uh, he would struggle with the the new clubs? Whenever Faldo came out and said that. Well, well, I mean, it's only in my in my view, and <clears throat> I could be wrong, but I, I look at it, and I sort of think you can almost draw a line in the sand, where as soon as he started up with the new equipment, his game went, his game suffered. So, I mean, to me, that that indicates that there was a problem there. You know, I mean. Maybe there wasn't, but to me, that's just the, that's the evidence, and it continued, and um, but I think that with the with the finances that Nike have, you know, they're you know they've invested whatever it was a colossal amount of money into Rory. Well, naturally, their R and D should be able to come up eventually with a club that's going to suit them, and I think they have. And um, once again, just seeing them recently there down in the Middle East, I mean, it's just absolutely phenomenal. It is. It's it's very, very intimidating to sort of see, uh, you know, how can you possibly compete with that?